The International Olympic Committee did not ban or ask Taiwan not to take part. What the, the executive did was to endeavor, in view of the action taken by the Canadian government, to find a solution to allow the athletes from Taiwan to compete. As I explained at the first press conference, they would not, the Republic of China, change their name to Taiwan. We subsequently suggested, because it's not our duty to force them to do anything, that they should compete in view of the circumstances and in the interests of the athletes under the Olympic flag. This is agreed in principle and indeed largely in detail with the Canadian authorities.